Hello and welcome to Tip and Trick RAC003 titled Attaching Walls to Roofs. The purpose of the tip and trick is to enhance your skills and share with you solutions to problems that other users experience. Our tips and tricks are created from the top 30 support calls logged with our support desk. If you require any more information on our support desk, then please contact customer services on 01784 419911 or you can email customer.services at cadline.co.uk. All of our tips and tricks can also be found on our website which is www.cadline.co.uk and please remember we are issuing tips and tricks for all Autodesk products as well as the one you're about to watch. Okay, so we're going to take a look at attaching walls to roofs in this tip and trick. Normally it's quite a straightforward procedure. Um, for instance, in this example, we can click on this wall and literally click attach and then click our roof. And that has now closed up the gap. Now one thing you will notice is that if you just rotate round a tad, if I just zoom in here, you can see we've got a slight gap where in fact our wall hasn't gone all the way around. The easy way around this if I just undo that and bring that back to this state here, if I currently take a look at my level zero and you can see that I've put in a couple of section markers in here just to show you the current standing, if you like, of our walls in conjunction with our roofs. So here we can see there's a clear gap and also if I go to my section two, so again, that's going to look this way. There we go, we can see it's now currently just short of our roof. So if I go into my 3D view, Again, as I said, you can go around and just do each of these walls manually one by one. Um, again, it will still work and still do fine, but a quicker and easier way of doing this is to simply hover over one of your walls and just hit the tab key once. This will now highlight the string of your walls there. Just click with your left mouse button and now you'll see they're all highlighted. I'm now just going to click attach and select my roof. And now we will find if we rotate round, it is now in fact attached all the way round to our roof. And we can go in and just check that into our sections, like so. There you go, you can see in this area here. And section two as well. Also, everything is now nicely tied up. Okay, so that's how you can quickly attach your walls to your roofs in one go. Thanks very much.